Do you want to combine multiple products into one listing on Shopify without upgrading into Shopify Plus? You're in the right place. Hi, I'm Sarah from Nescale and today videos, I'm going to show you exactly how to create Shopify combined listing using the NS color swatch variant and matrix in just three simple steps. It is beginner friendly, fast to set up, and it's work even if you're not on Shopify Plus. So stick to the end because I want to share a real store examples and quick tips to make your listing look more cleaner and professional. Step number one, set up the NS color swatch variant images. First, let's install and activate the app. Head over to the Shopify App Store, search for NS color swatch variant images. Then click install. Once it's added, open the app from Shopify Admin and follow the quick get started instructions. Then click embedded app. You're redirected to the Shopify theme edition. Simply toggle on the switch next to the app name and hit save. Just like that, your app is live and ready to go. Step number two, display color swatches on your storefront. Now let's display your swatches on product and collection page. From the app's welcome screen, click your swatches style or go directly to your option configurations from the sidebar. By default, the app sees your latest hundreds products. If your product isn't listed, click Add Product Option to find it manually. Next, toggle on the option label display style on product page for the variants you want to turn into swatches. Remember, enable the second toggle below it to also display swatches on your collection page. Here, see the drop down to select swatch uh, shapes. Choose from swear, circle, or build. Exterior enclosure live review. I will with circular swatch, clean and minimal. So now choose how to present your variant visuals. Uh, first, you can use your existing Shopify variant images, or if you choose the option to click edit swatch to assign visuals. In the pop-up assign a colors or image to each variant, just make sure each swatch match the correct variant name. Once you're finished, click done then hit save. So now we go to the step number three, customize the design of your swatches. Let's give your swatches some style and match your store branding. First, from the app menus, go to your design settings. You'll see through separate sections, one for product page, one for collection page. You can style both the same or give each a unique look. So now you'll see five customization categories, general settings, image setting, selected swatch, unselected swatch and hobo swatch so if you want to know detail about these categories just hit comment below so i will make a videos about it once everything looks great click save to apply your design updates now let's move into the last step which is show combined listing on your shopify store in the apps left sidebar click on product groups and hit create product group name your product group for example, I name my billows because I want to group all below related product into one combined listing. So then select your product to group, choose all the below products available in your store that you want to combine under this group. Once you are selected to draw products, hit save to finalize the group. Remember to toggle on, make sure to enable the display options so your combined listing will show up correctly on the product page and collection page. So now preview your store, navigate to your storefronts and you now see all the below variants combined into a single product list which clickable swatches. And finally, this feature lets your display related items as clickable swatches directly on your product page and collection page. It makes cost selling effortless and can seriously boost your average order values. So now, to just do a combat product listing that's clean, professional, and optimized for conversion. If you see this video helpful, feel free to hit the like button, subscribe, and leave a comment below. And if you want an easiest way to manage color swatches, variants, images, or even show dynamic estimated delivery date, uh, check out my other video right up here. 
or click the link below if you want some more tips to polish your store like showing swatches on collection page or quick view pop up. Check my other video over right here. And that is for today. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you for the next one.